how to perform wipe cache partition on the Moto G for the Lollipop version. So if you have a phone and you update the software to um, Android 5 Lollipop versions, then getting into a recovery menu is a little bit different to the KitKat version. So I'll show you how. First press and hold to the power button to shut down the phone. Choose power off, tap on OK, and this will shut down the phone. Next we're going to try to go into the recovery menu. So press and hold onto the volume down key for 3 seconds. 1, 2, 3, then press and hold onto the power key for a few more seconds, around 3 to 5, and let go. Ok, now that we're into the uh, boot mode selection menu, we use the volume down key to go down to recovery. So press on the down volume to go to recovery. Then press on the volume up key to make the selection. So I'll select that and now wait. Now on the next screen, on this uh, particular screen here, here is where the difference between the KitKat versions and the Lollipop versions. On the Lollipop versions, which is the latest um, 5.0, what you need to do is you need to press on the power key and then press on the press and hold onto the power key and press on the volume up key and let go. So this one go first and then this one go second. Whereas on the KitKat version, you press on the volume up key first and then you press on the power key second. So for the lollipop version, again, you press on the power key first and then you press on the volume key. And that's how you can uh, get into the menu. Because I'm still running on the uh, KitKat versions, so I need to press on the volume up key and press on the power key and let go. And that's how I get into this uh, particular menu. And once you're in this particular menu, it will be the same. You go down by using the volume key. So go down and choose wipe cache partition then press on the power key to make the selections and just wait for the erasing to complete and that's it that's the key that is the key difference between the KitKat and the lollipop um, you need to do in reverse so in lollipop you need to press on the power key first and then the volume up key and that's it thank you for watching this video